So you had a great week last week. You beat Novak Djokovic in Monte Carlo. What's that done for your confidence? Yeah, um, it was a great week in Monte Carlo and I played um, really good tennis there. Uh, it's really nice to play some uh, good tennis on clay for the first tournament of the clay season. So it's, um, yeah, I'm here with a lot of confidence in Barcelona. So um, I hope I can uh, keep going and maintain the same level this week. And you're in the top 10 in the world rankings now. What are your hopes for the, for the year and for the clay court season? Yeah, I'm back for the second time in the top 10, so I'm really happy um, after a good week. Um, so I hope I can s I can stay there until the end of the year, but um, yeah, the ranking doesn't matter, doesn't matter. I just, uh, I'm just focused on one, uh, what I have to improve, what I have to do on the court. And, uh, and yeah, we will see how at the end of the season, but uh, of course I'm feeling good for the moment. I'm playing my, uh, it's the best uh, start of the season I, I did for the moment, so I'm uh, just try to uh, keep going like this. And in terms of your success in the ATP 500 tournaments, you've reached three finals. How do you make the breakthrough to turn those runner-up places into winners? Yeah, the ATP 500 is always a good tournament. Um, you always want to go uh, far in the draw, so I'm always well prepared for those tournaments. And uh, yeah, in Rotterdam I played really well. It was. Uh, um, a great week there in Tokyo so last year so uh, now we try to do uh, another good week here in Barcelona um, but uh, yeah the level is really high this week but it's an ATP 500 and there is a lot of uh, points to take so I'm gonna give everything to uh, to go as far as I can. And it's your second time at the Barcelona Open how does it feel to be back here? Um, yeah, I'm really happy to be here. Uh, it's a really nice tournament. I, I love the the club, and um, it's a yeah. The the courts are really nice, so I'm feeling really good here in this in this club, and uh, the conditions also. It's uh, the weather is perfect, so uh, I hope it's going to be a great week for me. Um, and also the city. I love the city, so uh, it's uh, it's nice to be back here for only the second time, but. Uh, um, Hopefully I can stay uh, until the end of the week. And of course, Rafa won his 10th Monte Carlo Masters title last week. Just how amazing is that, an achie is that as an achievement? Yeah, it's amazing. Just uh, to win ten, ten, ten times the the same tournament, it's, it's already amazing. But the Masters 1000, like uh, Monte Carlo, it's just... Uh, yeah, unbelievable. He won everything on, on clay and especially there. He always played his best tennis in Monte Carlo, so it's it's amazing. He's a great champion. He's uh, he's the best player on uh, on clay court we can have for the moment. So, uh, but I'm sure he he wants more and uh, he deserves it for sure.